got sunshine today. Oh yeah, and I'm loving it. At least we're finally in the area where there is very little snow to none. I haven't seen very much snow at all lately, so I think today is going to be a good day driving. Now we only have about 480 miles to go. And then we will be uh, at our delivery place already, you know. Uh, that should be doable, no problem doing that today. We are probably about uh, 30 miles away from uh, Topeka, I think that's what they call it. Uh, Kansas. We are on uh, US 75 right now. And it's not as windy today either than what it was yesterday. Yesterday it was very, very windy. Uh, sometimes up to like 35 mile an hour wind. So that wasn't that wasn't very pleasant, but today seems to be a good day and we will make the best of it anyways. No matter what the nature throws at it, we will try and do the best. I try to keep positive in every situation that I can. Because I've learned over time that being negative or getting mad at stuff doesn't do you any good. So I just try to stay and look at the positive side of everything. Here we are. We are in Oklahoma. It looks pretty dry up here. Not much green going on, but hey, at least it's not white stuff on the ground anymore. And it's above zero degrees. So I was looking earlier and it was like 14 uh, Celsius already. That's a lot better than it is back home. Back home I think it's like minus 11 today. But uh, yeah, we're making good time. Got me uh, 400 kilometers in already today. And it's right around lunchtime right now. But the wind has turned around, it's blowing from the south now, or southwest. Gotta go against the wind now. But my turbo seems to be making some noises here lately. I don't know what's going on, but at least I think it's my turbo. Really worried about my turbo, I don't know what's happening. Right now it's nice and quiet, but... I think yesterday's video you'll probably have noticed when I was in uh, Sioux Falls, uh, South Dakota there when I was showing you guys that uh, army truck there, it was pretty noisy there and that was, I think that was my turbo doing that, so when I get back, hopefully I'll, uh, I'll go to my mechanic, I talk to him, see if, uh, if I make it back, I'll go see, see him and See what he thinks, if it's my turbo or what it's doing. And we'll find out, I guess. But we'll keep her moving as long as it works. And hopefully it doesn't blow apart on me. Because then it can do some damage. That's the last thing I would want. Oh well, we'll just have to take her easy and hope for the best. It was five o'clock in the morning And since one o'clock he had been driving Trucker Rudy was unforgiven And with every mile he made a living For the kids and for the wife He tried to live a better life But like Uncle used to say You've been living, my son, 
by the knife It was just before sunrise And fog was setting in When it hit him And by surprise Against the ripper We can't win Daddy, I see you rockin' heaven Daddy, I see you hit the road Daddy, I see you rockin' heaven Daddy, there is no less load Another truck in the wrong lane a heavy load of propane There was nothing that you could do All I want to do is go with you He was still alive when the flame stroke But it was too late, there was no hope No last goodbye no more calling home It's time to go When the hammer falls Daddy, I see you truck and have Daddy, I see you hit the road Daddy, I see you truck in heaven Daddy, there is no less low Good, you're gonna be able to see it, but right here to the left looks like they're building a brand new casino. They must be doing good in that casino, otherwise, they wouldn't be able to build another one like that. But that looks pretty good. I like it. We are just short of entering Texas right now, and so we're only about 30 miles away to our delivery location, you know. River, that's where Texas State Line is. Here we go. Here you'll see the sign right up here on the left. Welcome to Texas. Border, entering Texas. Yeah, I like that. Look at that big star right up there in that rest area. I don't know if you won't be able to see it, but oh, it's a welcome center up there. Looks like a nice tourist uh, attraction there that they got going on up there. Texas is big, that's for sure. We well, got another scale up here, but the lights are out, so we shall be okay. Well, here we are at the Walmart. We got uh, quite a few uh, trucks up here parked. That's where I'm parked at. And as you guys can probably see, I am walking around without a jacket. Now that's in the warmer state of Texas so I think I'm just gonna go move my truck around onto that side because it's uh, quite a bit on an angle going down like that 
I don't like sleeping like that, so I think I'm gonna go turn around and park on the other side of that guy so that way I'm not as bad on an angle so that way I can sleep properly. I just came back from a little bit of shopping and bought me a little bit of oil and got me a couple of movies. They got them up here pretty cheap, so here we go. That about is gonna do it for me today. <clears throat> I am done starting to get dark right now but uh, hey i don't have to get up early tomorrow morning so guess what i'm gonna be watching me some movies or at least one movie probably i went and grabbed me a few movies up here they had a few deals here you grab one case uh, had five movies in and one had four movies in so <clears throat> we should be in good shape and uh so tomorrow morning we'll go deliver a load uh, it's only supposed to be delivered at 9 a.m and then we will be on our way over to houston texas to do our reload up there and then uh, we are going to go to uh, madison hat alberta yeah that's a long trip so with that we will catch you again tomorrow at 5 a.m so stay tuned for that and we'll see you then thanks for watching